guys welcome back to my channel this is my first ever voiceover so i'm sorry if it's a little awkward <laughs> i'm doing a flip through of my a6 rings today this a6 rings is a vander spec um you've probably seen it before i've done a lot of flip throughs of it just with different setups this setup is like a pink and blue cherry blossom theme using a lot of old happy scrappy stuff that i had lying around I decorated the pocket with like this little page marker with a bunny on it and these cute like foiled die cuts and I just thought they were so super cute and I love how sparkly and shiny they are. And then the first dashboard there, the acetate is from the Honey Bee Shop. And then I've also got this little sticker folder in the side pocket here with the Happy Scrappy stickers. I thought it would be good to put them there just to sort of encourage me to actually use them instead of just keeping them in a drawer. <laughs> I feel like if you put your stuff like front and center, you'll be more likely to grab it. Um, the dashboard underneath this little acetate here, it says you are capable of amazing things. It's from Laz and Kriya shop. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, so I'll link it below. And then I've got this little jelly dashboard with some Honey Bee Shop die cuts. And then the die cut on the back is from Wila Walla Co. Frank Hart's View. And then I've got my first section here is like a wellness section. I've got gratitude inserts that I put in here so that I can start doing some daily gratitude. And then I've also got some inserts that I'm using for like tracking my medicine and my symptoms and my upcoming doctor's appointments so I thought that instead of doing two sections like one for mental health and one for just my physical health I would just put it all in one section this next tab here this next section is my finance section and the only inserts that I have in here are these little bill tracker inserts these are from Muse Lab I think those are so cute with the ink splatter on them <laughs> This little dashboard here, I made this with freebies from Papershire. She has a Facebook group. And then I made a washi dashboard. And then I just used some more happy scrappy paper. And then this next section is my weekly section. I'm using some more Muse Lab inserts. I really love these weekly inserts. It's week on one page. And it just works really well for me right now because there's not a lot going on with the pandemic. It just gives me an overview of anything like essential that I need to get done through the week. And then another, I made this dashboard too using more freebie art from Papershire. And then another washi dashboard. This section uh, right here is my projects section and I covered it up with a sticky note because it's an idea that I don't have fully developed yet. But um. I thought I would use this for ideas that I get for content or or just to jot down notes or whatever. And I also have some little grid inserts back here. Those are also from Muse Lab. I'll link all the shops in the description bar. But I really love how she made those with the ink splatter. I think it's super cute. And then more paper from Happy Scrappy. And then another jelly dashboard with some die cuts. The Animal Crossing die cut, I think it's from Haley's Handmade Co. This last section that I'm flipping through in here, this is just like miscellaneous personal lists, things that I want to remember. Video games I'm looking forward to right there. I'm sure that I'll put a lot more lists in here, but I haven't filled it out and fleshed it out yet. Like, I want to list upcoming music releases that I don't want to miss, or, like, shop releases. And then here I've written down podcasts to listen to and books that I want to read. And I'm sure I'll add more to those lists later as time goes on. I also want to make lists of like shows that I want to watch or movies that are coming out that I want to see. I like to make lists of stuff like that because sometimes I'll see a trailer for a movie that I think looks cool and then I just totally forget about it. And then I just have this little, um, a few little things tucked into the back pocket here. This is, I don't know what I'm doing with these to be honest. I see everybody using these task cards and I just thought, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I guess this is my 
attempt to to utilize these and see how people use them and see if I if I use them. Oh man, look at me trying to jump on board planner trends. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. Well, thank you guys so, so much for watching. That's the flip. It's a pretty simple planner flip through. I like to keep it pretty simple in my A6 rings. It's mostly like just lists and stuff. Um, see you guys in the next video. Bye.